Facebook. Are we live? Are we really live? You say we're live, but now... Now you say we're live. I get mixed signals. It says live on the little preview thing. And then down there it says, oh no, now we're really for realsy live. <sighs> this is why, you know, I don't normally use this platform, don't normally use these tools. But for this, it is worth it. I'm going to give you an update again, um, if you'll give me a few seconds, on my fundraising for St. Jude Children's Research Hospital, which has gotten off to a slower start compared to previous years, but um, there's still plenty of time to catch up. And so I'm, I'm hoping you'll consider being a part of helping me to do that. Um, let's see. I did make a mistake when updating my recipients list this year because uh, I'm basically sharing the email that I sent out to people this year. And so like half the people that I intended to get the, <laughs> the email didn't get it. So that might be part of the reason why. But anyway, um, yeah. So at this point, I'm at 38% of my $500 goal. I was at 81% by this time last year. So that gives you an idea of kind of where things are at. Um, I've raised $190 of the 500 that I'm aiming for. That's just $10 away right now from unlocking the free download day for everyone to get free audio dramas at spiritblade.com. The Christian Geek Central Game Save Team, which I am leading for this event, has reached 22% of our $1,500 goal. We were at 42% percent uh, by this time last year. I also goofed and forgot to activate milestone markers on my donation page on the donation line that fills up as I, you know, get donations. That's been fixed and I'm also uh, extending the deadline of my get good live stream unlock until the end of this coming Monday, October 23rd. So if I reach my $500 goal by then, the, the final deadline for me is November 5th. But if I reach my $500 goal by the 23rd, by the end of the 23rd, I will perform a special four-hour Get Good live stream before the end of the year sometime, playing only frustratingly difficult video games in my collection. I do not play games to be frustrated. I avoid games that give me any level of frustration. Um, anyway, you can get more info about um, all of my fundraising incentives, and you can donate as well on my fundraising page. I put a link in the kind of description for this, uh, for this live video, uh, and it should go in the archived versions description as well. This has definitely been a financially difficult year for a lot of people. I feel like I'm hearing about major company layoffs every couple of weeks now and like it's been that way for months. Holly and I uh, got our taste of the instability that so many are experiencing right now earlier this year when she was part of a company-wide layoff uh, and given that she is our sole income provider that sent us into months of wondering, worrying, praying, considering major life changes. Um, it was an unpleasant but really a good experience for us as we learned to give a little more of our lives into God's hands. Um, and we're grateful that Holly found a new job despite our income being uh, significantly less now. But then, as I reflect on that, my mind starts to drift to those who lost jobs this year who maybe haven't found new ones yet, and who are also sleepless at night wondering and worrying while praying that their child will survive their fight against cancer. That is a scenario that is too terrifying me, too terrifying for me to dwell on um, for long. But it, but it does uh, light a fire under me as I continue forward in my fundraising this year. Because I know that there are families that are in that position whose children can and will survive because of the research and help of St. Jude Children's Research Hospital, that their research benefits hospitals all over the world, um, in addition to those kids that actually get treated at their hospital. Um, and uh, that treatment, that research, it's funded by donations from people like you and me. Uh, as a Christian, I feel a conviction and a responsibility to increasingly aim to love like Jesus loved, caring for societies unseen and neglected. And it's a monumental and impossible task to love like Jesus did. But I think that's part of why Jesus wanted people to function as a body, working together to represent beautiful and selfless love in this world that is so broken and is being torn apart every day by selfishness and hate. Um, I would love it if you would join me in this sort of stumbling, incomplete uh, imitation of, of, of the love of Jesus that is actually made more complete by our 
combined efforts. Uh, you can visit my fundraising page where there are still lots of crazy and fun milestones to unlock, rewards that you can get for your donation. Again, that link you should find in the description, and uh, I'd be really grateful for your consideration. Um, that's all for now. Thank you so much. Now I just got to see if I can turn this thing off. It is time again for Christian Geek Central's annual Game Save event, fundraising for St. Jude Children's Research Hospital, which provides free treatment for children facing life or death circumstances and shares its cutting edge, life saving research with hospitals all over the world. And once again this year, I'm drawing attention to our team's fundraising by performing a 24 hour marathon of video gaming that I will live stream on youtube.com slash Christian Geek Central beginning 6 a.m. Pacific time on Saturday, November 4th. You can donate or get more info by clicking on my fundraising page in the links below, where you'll also find incentives and rewards for doing so. On top of that, I've set fundraising milestones that will unlock strange and unusual happenings as I reach them. Finally, if I reach my $500 goal by the end of Thursday, October 19th, I will do a four-hour Get Good live stream before the end of the year, playing only the most frustrating, difficult games in my collection. Now, there are some stipulations and time limits on those rewards and milestones, so quickly follow the link below to my fundraising page for all the details. Believe it or not, this makes the 10th consecutive year of Christian Geek Central raising funds for kids in great need of medical care. I hope you'll be a part of helping me and the Christian Geek Central Game Save team do some good for some kids who really need it. And then please join me at youtube.com slash Christian Geek Central for my 24-hour marathon starting at 6 a.m. Pacific on Saturday, November 4th. Hope to see you there.